Big B groom took to Reddit to ask if he was wrong to call off his wedding. Why? He found out that his fiance told her friends that he's bad in the sack. She did add that he had a lot of other good qualities, <laughs> but who cares? <laughs> he takes out the garbage, he does the dishes, but in bed, eh. Yeah. Why tell your friends that your boyfriend is bad in bed? I mean, is it to prevent someone from stealing him? Why? Oh, oh that's a good take, that's actually. A good one. Well, here's the fundamental problem, though. There's a, there's, <laughs> there's a root problem to this case scenario, and it okay. is that both of them, the male and female, shared a best friend, a very close friend. Yes. No, no, no. Everybody needs individually their own best friend that you say things to that, that are, you know... It's a vault that, that will, will never say anything. And will always take your side. Exactly. Right. We'll have your back. Thank you, Regina. If you, you know, <laughs> have to bury the body, we'll be there for you. Do you can't who, be who sharing... Who is your person like that? Lee. Your friend Lee. My a guy. Is, a guy. A guy. Yeah. She will, she will not only take it to the grave, she'll bury the body with me. <laughs> yeah. I know, I know so that about her. I, so do you I have one? Do you I have do. One? Alex is mine. Alex and yours, but... Sarah? Let's just hear that. Yeah. yeah, and mine yeah. is Susie Essman. That's right. Who I love. The oh, fabulous, right. famous Susie. Herb is right. so good this season. I'm almost done with That's it. That's right. Um, and would, would Susie ever tell Never. She anyone? Defend, she defended me against a certain friend who was talking about me behind my back. See? Yeah. You see? But I see this a little different, and this might be a very old-fashioned take. I actually think... <laughs> In marriage, certain things are protected between the partners. I actually wouldn't share with my best friend something that I think would be embarrassing for him or that was yeah. something personal or intimate to him. So, like, I would be much more likely to go to my husband and be like, hey, let's try this. This is what I'm into uh -huh. and try to work with him. Because that feels like a little bit of a betrayal. No, she was be so this, yeah. this best friend between them is a female who's been raised with the man. So, like, mm. the, their parents were good friends. Uh -huh. She, like, literally, they were really drunk, and she kept talking about it, and she's like, there's got to be something you don't like. So she pried, and then the husband pried with her, but I still think that there are some parts that you're out of bounds, and I think if the girl doesn't feel yeah. fulfilled, they seem a little young. They're 27, yeah. I think. Oh, and he can learn. To speak to, you need to speak to your partner. If you, you need want to things teach to Well, two things. They need to One, be taught. Men, to be raised. men need to be carefully taught what yeah. to no, do. No, listen, two things. One, if you're going to share something with a best friend, have to be the sober best friend, not the one that gets That's drunk. The drunk one, yeah. Because the drunk, the drunk one, you go drinking with, but don't tell things to. Yeah. Um, and I forgot point. what the second thing was. <laughs> well, let, let's talk real. about teaching men about sex. Yes. Do you think that that's true? What you, you have, have to I don't teach know if it's them. Just men. I, like I think any partner you have, you need well, to teach them. Well, but they're young. They're very young. These two Manny people, right? Twenty-seven and twenty. Uh, Twenty-seven. I wonder who taught Manny all those tricks. I mean, but, you know, a man doesn't necessarily know a woman's body until you, t t you know, draw a map. Manny yeah, but, knew. But it doesn't matter if you're... The, let me tell you something. The, the, the men making all of these laws about women's bodies don't know women's That's exactly bodies. That's true. That part is true. I think it's really... Any partner you're with, intimacy grows through that communication yeah. of learning someone. It's what makes it so special between two people. This guy's you don't so, come in just knowing what to do. This it's guy's really insecure, too. If I mean, They if dated for five years. He's willing to call off a wedding over this exactly. one. Yeah, yeah, because she said that he was it, bad in bed. It feels that's, like a betrayal, a betrayal of trust. Yeah. I would, but that's not why. Right. I don't think it was because she betrayed him. It's because she, he, she, he thinks... She, I mean, she knows he's bad in bed. It's the knowledge, not the secret. Mm, no, maybe a little bit of both. No, I think no, I she could have hit him in the ego, and that really hurt. Oh, she should have showed him. So told you what she wanted. To tell oh, us. I have something. Sorry. Yeah. Yes, we do. So ESPN is the home of the women's final four Yay! tonight. <laughs> NC State takes on number one seed and undefeated South Carolina at seven Eastern, followed by number three UConn versus number one Iowa. <laughs> And Caitlin Clark, the coverage begins with the Final Four special at 6 Eastern. There's so Ooh. much excitement over this. She it's loves so, it's, it's, Iowa. But I do. So, but she's it's so Iowa. great to see women I love, basketball. No, but everybody's yes. excited about these. Because women uh, basketball just sports. brought in more than any other event. Yes. And women have not been doing that forever. Yeah. We'll be right